Peace. Hey, what's happening? Peace to the divine infinite consciousness. What's good? Yo, this is going to be real quick too, man. And this is going towards the sisters. And y'all can put it back on the brothers too. It don't matter. But, um, yeah. If y'all want to, you know, it's pertaining to the little royal wedding or whatever they want to call it. Uh, if y'all want to go deal or dabble with the with the grafted species, then um, be my guest. We really don't give a damn and shit in real life because it's really just exposing the ones, you know, that I won't even say I can't even get mad because it's a spiritual game here. You know what I mean? So who knows? Your karmic, you might have some kind of karmic debt that you may have to go do that. You know what I'm saying? So brothers, I'm just letting you know, <clears throat> let go when it comes to that shit. And the same thing, you're dealing with brothers who like, uh, who deal with the, the grafted chicks. You know what I'm saying? Uh, then, hey, you know, or the less recessive gene uh, people. Then, you know, hey, shit, let them go too because they're actually broken as well. It's, it's a double-edged sword. You know what I'm saying? And the reason why they're broken is because they don't know, they don't know what love is. They don't know the difference between love and lust. You know what I'm saying? See, love is going against or going actually through the hell it takes to come out right. The necessary hells that it takes to strengthen yourself and to, and to build yourself up. The lust is just an aspect of you just toxically involved with another person or being or, or something like that. You know what I'm saying? To be able to release some kind of energy that you don't know how to hold on to for yourself. So, you know, uh, pretty much you want to be able to harness your energy. And the only way you can do that is with someone that you love. You know, it don't even necessarily have to be with children or whatnot, but shit. You ain't got to misuse an individual individual because uh, your child ain't have a father or something like that. And you probably got three different baby dads or something like that. And you want to give your child a dad or something and you really not into the relationship. You know, that's not really right and exact either because you're not really building anything. You know what I'm saying? If anything, you're destroying. So, you know, uh, but I understand your intent. But like I say, you know, um, for the for the wisdoms who want to go with the grafted people, or, you know, you can go, there's other indigenous people in the world, but if you want to go with the grafted one, you know, this is the one that who forced this might all over the world and was given the opportunity to do it. You know what I'm saying? In real life, they're not powerful as you think they are. You know what I'm saying? They're just holding up a time right now. You know what I'm saying? And also in real life, the majority of them is gay. You know what I'm saying? And that's just how it is. And we, as a, as the original man, has been turned to look to that type shit regard, without having a foundation in the home and other men. You know what I'm saying? So you're gonna you're gonna experience that. You know, uh, you're gonna see that original man has to go through all kind of shit. People are just curious about what we think and who we are. You know what I'm saying? How when we walking down the street, niggas can't even breathe, chilling without a motherfucker coming up in, within 15 feet of our radius and seeing who the hell we is and trying to get some of our energy. You know what I'm saying? So the same thing for the woman, you know? So they took advantage of us when we was children, you know? So now we back together, we grown, we didn't know who we was. So now we gotta eat the right foods. Start linking up with the right beans. Start strengthening your own self so you can prepare yourself for the right one to come into your life. You know what I'm saying? The right ones, the necessary, necessary ones, you know? So it's not all about sex all the time. So that's why if you be able to retain your energies, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you can get a woman orgasms and stuff like that, but if you as a man can be able to retain your energies, then hey, You'll be able to um, you'll be able to call upon a, a, a soul or a spirit that's 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 willing to um, that's strong enough to fulfill the mission. You know what I'm saying? You do this shit out of lust. <laughs> Yo, that's just how it, it, that's what it is. You know what I'm saying? And it, we know it's more women in the world, and we know they run sex. So you can't do this shit out of lust. You gotta really be focused on this and be focused on your being. And feel your morale if you're here to strengthen yourself or you're here to just go with the flow and get money or some shit. You know what I'm saying? But with that being said, I like say peace. Well, love, you know what it is.